Our goal is to promote modern, thoughtful, and humane dog training practices. Be humane and not bite me. How about that? 100% of the money I receive on Patreon goes towards making these videos. I'll have a link in the description if you want to play a vital part in changing the way people think about teaching their dogs. Whether you're potty training a puppy or an older dog, I'm going to give you some tips today that will help you conquer potty training once and for all. Though I may have met my match today. Subscribe to see all kinds of awesome dogs do all kinds of awesome things. Click thumbs up. For Max, a fluffy corgi. Yeah, that's a thing, fluffy corgi puppies. It's the Metropolitan Box. There's much better things in the paper. I know it looks like a box of Chinese food, but it's so much more. Not only is it a dumpling, it's a squeaky dumpling. BarkBox has their own newspaper, specifically for dogs, because it squeaks. New York City, no grainers. I think this has its attention. Manners, please. Aren't you corgis supposed to be polite? You're like the queen's dogs. Where's your English manners? If your dog's got allergies, they've got great options for you. All of their treats are made in North America and all of their items come from local and small businesses. Don't worry, I'm gonna give you some. Hold on. They even have options for heavy chewers too. Not sure what part of an animal this is, but I have a hunch that Max is gonna love it. Max loves everything in his box, but if your dog didn't like something, BarkBox would replace it. Have a BarkBox automatically ship to the dogs you love and give them an extra special treat every month. You're gonna get a free BarkBox with a six or 12 month subscription with free shipping in the continental United States. I'm gonna have a link in the description. BarkBox.com slash dog training. Chances are if you've gotten a new puppy or dog, high on your priority list is getting them house trained. But we've got to keep our expectations realistic about this whole potty training process. See, it's not really instinctive for dogs to know to go outside to relieve themselves. We have to show them that outside is the place to go, and tightly controlling where they can and can't go during the potty training phase is really essential. And letting your dog outside unattended, ouch, is not exactly ideal either. In fact, you're almost guaranteed to get way faster results if you take a proactive role in the house training process by accompanying your dog outside. Don't bite me the toy. That's what this is for. You're... Don't. Whoa, don't. This is why we put harnesses on puppies. Even though potty training can take a fair amount of time to accomplish, you can get pretty serious results in that first month, especially if you seek out advice on modern methods from professional trainers, just like you're doing right now. A study in the Journal of the American Veterinary Medical Association found that pet parents who were counseled to house train their dogs by focusing on preventing potty accidents and avoiding using verbal punishment when accidents occurred had significantly better potty training results over the first month of house training. And these pet parents also used enzymatic cleaners to clean up potty accidents and that can be a big help too. So what about excitement or submissive urination? That's where your dog involuntarily pees when they get really excited or really nervous. Most dogs outgrow this by the time they're a couple of years old. In the meantime, do your best to have your dog relieve themselves before they're in a situation that's likely to make them nervous or excited. Exposing your dog to lots of new people and situations should minimize these types of accidents over time because these experiences become more normal to your dog. It's really easy to trigger potty training relapses too. For example, if you move or or if you're at a friend's house, or if you ease up a little bit too early on your consistency. <laughs> now, if this is you, be prepared to take a step back on your house training so you can help ease your dog through these changes. If you've noticed that your dog is having potty accidents and there have been no major changes to their life or their environment, get them to a vet to rule out any health issues, which are quite common. I don't recommend letting your guard down at all for at least a year if you've got a young puppy like this, and maybe six months or so if you've got an older dog. Would you trust this face? So remember, the ultimate secret to potty training your dog is understanding that it can take many months to fully accomplish, but it's really not that hard as long as you're super consistent. I'm gonna have a link in the description to a detailed step-by-step -step lesson on how to house train your dog. <laughs> Click thumbs up for Max the Fluffy Corgi. He's just awesome. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel too. Oh, you wanna play rough, huh? Get a free BarkBox when you sign your favorite dog up for a six or 12 month BarkBox subscription at BarkBox.com slash dog training. I'll have a link in the description. Thank you so much to our patrons for supporting this and all of our episodes. You guys rock. I'll have that link in the description too if you wanna help us make more videos just like this one. Good job, buddy.